Today we celebrate St. Peter Chanel. Hardships, frustrations, disappointment, and martyrdom mark the final days of Peter Chanel, but he died a happy man. Serving in the foreign missions had long been a dream. Ordained in 1827, Peter was eager to leave his native France and preach the gospel in a far-off land. After joining the Marist congregation and spending several years in various leadership posts, he was assigned to serve in the islands of the South Pacific. Peter and his companions received a warm welcome when they reached the island of Fatuna, but the local natives were misinformed about the nature of their mission. After it became clear that the priests were seeking converts rather than simply trying to learn the local languages and customs, the picture darkened. When the son of the king was among those who requested baptism, he ordered that the missionaries be killed. Peter was clubbed to death. Through his final hours, he maintained his serene and gentle spirit and his courage. Following Peter Chanel's death in 1841, Christianity flourished in the area. He is the first martyr of Oceania and its patron.